something that I learned from the Oslo Freedom Forum more than any other place is how technology can benefit freedom. The challenge is really getting people who are good at tech and who also care about human rights and bridging that gap. I believe it's very important for technologists and activists to work hand in hand together because technologists are very good at developing awesome products while activists are very good at uncovering the human side. I think social networks have played a really vital role in offering anonymity to activists and journalists and civil society groups, particularly in places where they would face blowback for organizing movement. What if we transformed that sentence, right, transformed that phrase, billionaire, and said, the new billionaire is not just somebody who makes a billion dollars, the new billionaire is somebody who positively touches a billion people. Because if we don't use these expanded capacities to impact the world in a positive way, and it's all for nothing. Over time, the dictators have gotten really good at using technology, and it's important for the activists to get as good as using the technology as the dictators. And technologists are, are here and the ones that can really help bridge that gap. It's so important that we get the digital world right. This is the way that we uh, communicate throughout the world. This is the way that we congregate. This is the way that we work together. Uh, this is the, uh, a very strong binding force of humanity. Activists are now facing, you know, a, a huge volume of threats um, all around the world. And I think they really need to benefit from the technical expertise that technologists can provide. The more technology advances, becomes easier to use in difficult situations, the more the people who are working to advance freedom will be better at their job. When you realize that these are people and you hear their backstories, you can't forget it. You can't not be involved. Without people on the ground and the activists working, technologists will never know how to perfect these tools. You know, if our fellow brothers and sisters are suffering, then these technological advancements mean nothing.